Welcome again to another video from the Micro Rooster. Today's topic is uh, combination. We're going to use ACLs and edit links. We're just going to have some fun with them. Let's start with the desktop. In this case, I have two kinds of users. I have something like customers. I can use a generic customer for demo purposes. And I have another user, maybe a developer or a third party user or a manager. I want to make sure that these two users can access the same report, but pr produce different data or data links. So how do I do that? There's multiple ways to think about this, but one neat way that is combining the ACLs with edit links. So in this case, let's look at this report. I just copied it and I'm going to modify it where I already modified it. So this is a sales by region report from the tutorial. It has region category, subcategory, and it's got the revenue and it had the units sold. So what do I do with this report? I just modified it to include units sold and units sold full, which is a copy of units sold. So I just made a copy of this metric. So here's the metric, the original metric, sum of units sold, and this is just a copy of it. For the first one, what I want to do is on the security level, I want to say my third party users cannot see this report, only my customers. So my accountant in this case cannot see this this metric, but my customer can. On the next one, the full, I'm going to do the opposite. Look at the properties, security. And in this case, the accountant, my third user party user, has the view ability and the customer has no access to this metric. Okay, so back to our report. So we have these two metrics, one that allows customers to view it and one that allows my accountant or third party to view it. I'm interested in this, these two reports, these target reports. The full sales, let's look at it quickly. The full sales by region will have some additional metrics such as profit and cost in addition to the revenue. This might be information that you don't want your customer, for instance, to use. And in this case, you want them to run a limited sales by region report and in this case it would have maybe yes yeah, just the cost would be sufficient for your users in this case so how do i allow my sales by region report to drill to either one well by adding these two duplicate metrics i can achieve that because i can what i can do here is going to look at the properties of the edit link sorry the edit link and i can say i'm going to let this run a report called limited sales by region okay and the full I'm gonna let it run the full sales by region and now because these two have different security levels again the security level let me take a quick look at them double check the unit sold is allowing customers to view but not my accountant and the unit sold full does the opposite and it will say the third party accountant has the view control. The customer has a denied all object. Okay, so now let's see how this works. Let's go and run this report quickly. Let's go to shared reports and let's look at this report. And here's the report. Let's just run it for a bunch of regions, categories, and see what it does. All right, great. And notice I only see units sold full and I'm going to click on it. And let's just do maybe a couple here. And there you go. I see the cost, revenue and profit as I predicted. OK, but let's go back now and log in as the customer. And now let's go to our same report. And let's try to run the same categories. There's a different metric, the unit sold, not the unit sold full. So now when I click on this, okay, we should see cost only and not see the other items, the revenue and the profit. So this, you can see how this is a very unique way of you know, doing or controlling your drilling capabilities because you're creating one report called the sales by region, but you're allowing it 
to be controlled by the ACLs by hiding things and enabling things at the same time, allowing full functionality of drilling to different paths. So the user really doesn't know that there's a different path for a different user because they only see one path. Thank you very much for watching this video.